Animals and their young ones. Class 4. Science. Look at the given pictures. Match the animals with their young ones. Excellent job. Now, answer some questions. Do all the animals resemble their parents? Yes. Are they of the same size as their parents? No. The ability to produce more of their own kind is called reproduction. Animals reproduce in two methods. Laying eggs and giving birth to young ones. Let us first learn about egg-laying animals. Many animals reproduce by laying eggs. The eggs are either kept in a warm place, or the parent animal sits on them to keep the eggs warm. Once the eggs mature, the young ones hatch out. Birds All birds reproduce by laying eggs. Most birds build nests on trees to lay their eggs and to raise their young ones. Parts of an egg A egg has a thin protective shell, called the egg shell. Within the egg shell, is a white jelly-like substance, called the albumin, which is rich in proteins. The yellow inner part of the egg is, the yolk. And it is rich in fats, vitamins, and minerals. The yolk contains food for the growing baby or the embryo. The embryo develops into a chick. Within the egg, the embryo goes through various stages of development, before the egg hatches, and the chick comes out. The chick then grows into an adult. Various stages of development, from an embryo to a mature adult, is called the life cycle of an animal. Besides birds, Animals such as frog, fish, turtle, lizard, crocodile, snake, cockroach, butterfly, bee, mosquito, and grasshopper also lay eggs. Hen The mother hen lays eggs in her nest and sits on them to keep them warm. This helps the embryo to develop better and faster. Once the embryo within the egg has developed into a chick, the chick breaks the shell to come out. This is called hatching. The young chick then grows up to become an adult hen. Frog A frog lays eggs in water in large clusters, called spawns. A tadpole hatches out of the egg, which looks very different from the adult frog. It undergoes several changes through a process, known as metamorphosis, before it becomes an adult. A complete change from a young form to an adult form is called metamorphosis. Butterfly The life cycle of a butterfly also shows metamorphosis. The caterpillar that comes out from the egg, looks very different from a fully grown butterfly. This process of shedding the old skin is called molting. Animals that give birth to young ones Some animals do not lay eggs. They reproduce by giving birth to young ones, that feed on their mother's milk. Mammals are examples of such animals. Mammals have very well-developed brains. Most mammals have hair on their body. Human beings Along with dog Cat Lion Elephant Deer Cow Buffalo Hippopotamus Zebra Giraffe Monkey and rabbit, are some common examples of mammals. Whales and dolphins are mammals found in water, but they do not have hair on the body. 
Most mammals live on land and breathe through the lungs. Do you know how whales and dolphins breathe? They also breathe through the lungs. They take in air through blowholes present on the top of their heads. Hence, they have to come to the surface of the water to breathe in air. Animals look after their young ones. All the mammals look after their babies. Most of them build houses to protect their babies from enemies. And also hunt for food. The mother feeds her babies her own milk. She cleans them and keeps them warm. Birds, too, look after their babies. They build nests to keep them warm. Since the chicks cannot fly, parent birds get food for their chicks and also protect them from any danger. Let's remember living things have the ability to reproduce. Animals reproduce by either laying eggs or by giving birth to young ones. An egg has a shell called the eggshell, a white jelly-like substance called albumin, which is rich in protein, and yolk. A baby butterfly is a caterpillar, then it becomes a pupa before it turns into a butterfly. Mammals are animals that give birth to young ones. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel, and do not forget, to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.